Toy Hotel. Book your suite today. That turned out great! I know, I can't believe our very first nationwide commercial for the Toy Hotel just aired on TV! Addie and Maya, you two stole the show. Nice work! Thanks, Blob Jason. I can't believe the commercial's going to be seen all over the country. I know, I bet the phones are going to be ringing off the hook for reservations, so I better get to the registration desk soon. Book your suite today. I can't believe my identical twin sister Lucy is running a toy hotel. A toy hotel! Why does she get all the toys all the time? It's just like when we were growing up. I'm gonna have to do something about this. Okay, I have you down for four nights in the Hello Kitty suite beginning October 8th. Thank you for choosing the toy hotel. Wow, that commercial really did wonders, didn't it? Sure did. We're practically booked for the end of the year. While the phone isn't ringing, I'm going to run down to the basement and grab some toys put behind Addie and Maya's pillows. I'll be right back. Okay, sounds great. <laughs> I look just like my twin sister Lucy. No one will ever know it's actually me, Tabitha, Lucy's long lost mean twin sister. <laughs> I'm going to have some fun today. <laughs> that again? Uh, just around the corner. First door on the left. Oh, right. Pardon me, just one minute. That's odd. Looks like a basement to me. I hope you like the basement, Lucy, because you're going to be spending a lot of time down there today. <laughs> oh, did you get the toys to put behind Addie and Maya's pillows? Oh. I seem to have forgotten those. Well, you could always use some of the toys behind the registration desk, I suppose. Yes, great idea. You know what, why don't you go ahead and take the day off today? I think I can handle everything back here just fine. Really? You don't need the help today? With that commercial driving in all that extra business, it might get a little chaotic. Nope, I'll be just fine. Go ahead, get on out of here. Well, if you insist, just give me a call if you change your mind. Well, now that he's out of my hair, I can cause some real trouble today. <laughs> All right, Addy, push the button two times. Ah! That actually scared me. This game is super fun, my. But do you know what I just realized? What, Addy? We never checked behind our pillows to see what toys Lucy left us today. You're right, let's go see. There's always a new toy for us. Every single day. Let's pick up the game and talk to Miss Lucy. Good idea, Maya. Boy, the girls are just gonna love these toys. How did that happen? I'm locked down here. Someone's gotta let me out. Hello? Hello? something I just might like. The kids at this toy hotel get toys, toys, toys all day long. Now it's my turn to get some toys. Come here, little twisty pet. Zaggy zebra, marvelous monkey, cutie kitty. Time to turn them into bracelets. <laughs> I love these. <laughs> And you know what? These spoiled kids at the toy hotel don't need twisty pets. They need something more practical. Something like staples. I'll give them staples. Perfect. Yep, every kid could use a few staples. No cutie kitty for you. <laughs> you get staples. Paper clips. Kids need paper clips too. I get Zaggy Zebra. You get paper clips. <laughs> Yeah, we looked really well, but there's nothing. Oh, 
So you think you just get to wake up every day and get new toys just because. Not your birthday, not a holiday, it's just a new day so I get toys. But this is the toy hotel, isn't that how it works? Not from here on out. From now on, you have to purchase your toys here just like everybody else. Really? Are you okay, Lucy? Oh, I'm just fine. Now, I happen to have two Twisty Pets here. They're all yours for just $20. Oh, I do love Twisty Pets. What do you say, Maya? I do love them too, but I guess we could pay $20. Thank you. Now, here are your Twisty Pets. Now, do me a favor. Don't open them until you get your fancy little toy suite. And there you go. Okay, thanks, I guess. Have fun with your twisty pets. <laughs> Oops, I mean staples and paper clips. <laughs> Let's see what other toys are down here that I'm dying to have. <laughs> Did Lucy seem a little odd to you today, Maya? For sure, maybe she didn't get a good night's sleep. Well, hopefully she'll be in a better mood later. Yeah, let's go get our twisty pets open now. Again, 
You won't believe what happened this time. Oh, really? Try me. There were dirty socks in my leg, okay? Lots of them. Well, I'm sure there's a washing machine somewhere in this joint. Go give them a good scrub. You'll have clean, warm feet. You're kidding, right? You're acting very different today. Are you sure you're okay? Oh, I'm perfectly fine. I'm just making some major changes in this joint. Life isn't all about toys, you know. Um, yeah, okay. Anyone, we'd like to exchange this dirty box of socks for another toy, please. I'm afraid we don't do exchanges or refunds. But we had socks in our Lego friend box. Well, perhaps you'd be interested in some schnooks. You know, open, shake, style. Hmm, that could be fun. Yeah, we can play on them. Tell you what, I'll give you a deal on these two. You can have them both for only $20. That's the last of all of our birthday money. Are you sure you want to spend it? Let's go to the drama. It could be fun. All right, then. Thank you for the money. Schnooks for you. Schnooks for you. <laughs> you two have a great time styling that hair. <laughs> all right, Mike, we can actually see the schnooks, so we know we're not going to get staples or dirty socks or anything crazy like that. Thank goodness. All I want to do today is play with a new toy. Lucy sure is making stuff difficult. I know, I just don't get all these changes. Lucy's always so nice and she usually loves to give us free toys. Well, let's get our schnooks open, Addy. What in the world is the matter with my schnook? I don't know what's wrong with your schnooks, but my schnooks got her hair cut off. Such a sad sight. I have a strawberry scented comb and all these cute hair accessories, but I can't even use them now. Yeah, how in the world am I supposed to style this one's hair? The hair is too short to do anything with. Back to the front desk. Hello? 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 Anyone here? Anyone here? Anyone down here all day long. Well, I came down here in the basement this morning to get some toys to hide behind your pillows, and then when I came up, the door was locked. I'm surprised Bill Hop Jason hasn't filmed me yet. Well, if you were down here all day, then you used that mean lady at the registration desk. Yeah, she's been tricking us all day. I think I know what's going on. <laughs> I can't believe my sister and those silly hotel guests have been the one having all the fun these past few years. Well, things are about to end because these toys are all mine now <laughs> and I'm gonna be the one having fun. Tabitha! Uh-oh, fun's about to end. I better grab all the toys I can and run! Oh, she got away. I don't care if she got away. I just care if she never comes back. Oh, we'll make sure of that. And don't worry, girls, there aren't going to be any nonsense changes at the Toy Hotel as long as I'm here. Thank goodness. I'll give you your money back, and you can each take this giant pile of toys upstairs to your room and start unboxing them. Absolutely free. Not gonna pay for toys around here. Thanks, Lucy, you're the best. <laughs> you may have won this time, Lucy, but don't worry, <laughs> that won't be the last of me. I'm gonna come back with an even better plan next time. <laughs> These twisty pets had staplers and paper clips. There was paper clips and staples inside our poopy clips. There were staples and pa <laughs> there were staples and paper clips inside our twisty pets. Yay! Yes! <laughs> yes! Bye. <laughs>